what were you excited about for um, Lisa's um, character development this season? Oh my gosh. So the thing I talked about with the writers was happiness. <laughs> I wanted Lisa to smile a little yeah. bit <laughs> because, you know, uh, you know, she, she's a grounding presence. She's a voice of reason, but that also, she still had to deal with um, everything thrown her way. So I was like, you know what? I want a little fun. Let's, 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 let's see her relax a little bit. And I think we see that a little bit in season two. And Jordan, what about you and Jazz? Uh, you know, you know, as a character, I mean, it's, it's always, it's always extremely cool being like the cool guy, you know, mm -hmm. on it. But I'm excited for this season because you'll see little glimpses of me, you know, maybe losing my cool a little bit and uh, kind of losing myself, the coolness of myself because a situation has jaded me. Mm. And um, I think that's important for viewers to see because everybody's not perfect, mm -hmm. you know? So like, you'll you'll see some imperfections with jazz this, this season, but I'm excited for it. I'm excited to show that like, you know, everybody goes through stuff and everybody sometimes can't keep their cool and everybody sometimes, you know, wish they wouldn't have done something and apologize and, you know, um, Maybe it'll be too late, you know, maybe not. So um, excited for everyone to see kind of like the different facets of jazz. Amazing. So season one, we got to set up the world, got to ground yourselves in the characters and make them your own. So going in in season two and the relationships that develop over the course of this, what for you was the one that you were most curious about exploring? Hmm. Uh, mm. well, I think I was more, I think I was curious about exploring a relationship between Jazz and Hillary, really. And, um, you know, without giving any spoilers of like how we end up or anything, um, I think it's important for people to see like how a relationship is. Um, and in that just, uh, you know, trials and tribulations in a relationship. And if you can, overcome it or do you you know or are certain things you can't take or do you love her so much that she'll let certain stuff slide because of your love and that's something that everybody goes through you know especially in relationships so I was excited for that to be the storyline obviously we don't get the whole season you know beforehand we get it kind of like whenever we're done with the last episode we'll get the script and so each week it was fun reading to see where they wanted to take my character mm -hmm. and how I wanted to portray it see if love is enough um so simone <laughs> for you a lot of the storyline takes place this season inside the school and the challenges that happen in that sort of environment with black teachers and the students and how those interactions come so in following that storyline what for you was intriguing about it and that you enjoyed having the audience get to share in that moment what's intriguing about um being at school um are the stakes because in high school one you're just everything feels like the biggest deal ever and also like you're living you're living um history in real time you know and so um and, and so it it and the young minds, I think, are what push everything forward. And so having a good example of like young black leaders, you know, standing up for something that they don't feel is right and um, and really making change, I think I think that's exciting and I think that's beautiful. And with each character, you get to see a different angle of like m maybe why they're doing it or how they're doing it, because there's not one way to um, to make the world better. So one of the big things that's important in this series are, is chosen family, not only blood ties, but the family that you choose and those relationships that you explore. So in seeing that, whose storyline are both of you excited to follow outside of your own this season? Mm. Mm. I like that one. I like that one. You like that? All right. I like that <laughs> one. She me, per me personally, I, I, I'm... I mean, also like <laughs> I already know the storyline, but <laughs> <laughs> I know I'm like, but I'm excited to follow uh, Carlton's yes storyline. Carlton has a just like season one, he has a crazy arc. He's having another crazy arc this season, and uh, he's also a, a very talented, talented actor. Yes, and uh, conveys all emotions, and then, you know, really is acting in this. So very excited to see that you know coming to to, to the big screen.
I would say jazz. Oh, oh. oh my God. Not for, oh. not for him. Not for him, but because, you know, the, especially the, the one reference point we have of the original. And so we get such, we get such little, um, little moments of jazz and to really have him expand and we get to see parts of him that are so intimate you know his his love life his faith his family I think it's and then and then also his relationship with Will I mean like can't get cooler than that